Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Marks, is that you? Uh, you didn't have to get up on my account. Looks like you've done some cleaning. Fewer cobwebs. Oh, we still have some areas over here that need working on. But, uh, this is nice. Table. Clean. Food. Good May your work. next fight bring you victory, friend. Thank you. All right, well, it's time for me to get some sleep. I have a assassination to attend to in the morning. I'll see you then. to be back in white run let's see what my followers have done with this place seems cleaner food on the table hmm, there's still some cobwebs back here in the corner they have work to do <laughs> but all is well and proceeding according to my plan Harold, I know you're deeply asleep, and I won't disturb you, but there are some things that you should know, <laughs> as your memory has been partially restored, there's still some things that you don't know about me. I've gone by many names over the millennium. Zavros, the Master, Sithis, an old brown elf who laughs too much. <laughs> but you may call me the One. <laughs> Continue on this path with the Dark Brotherhood. It will lead you to the Dragonborn. And when you find him, you must destroy him. That way, his power will become yours. <laughs> the one. The one. He is the one. And lastly, a parting gift. What? What was that? <laughs> the one has done something to me. Strengthened me. Yes, sneak, 
at 100. I suppose I'll need it for what's ahead. All right, I'd better get dressed and ready for my contract. There. Ready. What? Mox? May your next fight bring you victory, friend. You're not giant-sized anymore. Huh. The Master? I mean, the One? He... did something to you, probably made you stronger in other ways. Well, welcome to my world. <laughs> yeah. Now, now you can get through the doors. All right. I'll be back. If you can uh, straighten up this place a little bit more, that would be great. I have someone to kill. <laughs> is here in Markarth. See if I can't find her. The one said he was also known as Sithis. That's incredible. Need something? I need you to get out of my way. You... Why are you looking at me like that? Why shouldn't I be looking at you like that? The Dark Brotherhood has come, Yuri. The Dark Brotherhood... Oh, oh, I... My goodness, you're really here. Get yourself Black together. Sacrament. It actually worked? Yes. It's obvious, isn't it? Now tell me what you need. What I need? What I need is for Elaine Dufont to die. I want him hunted down and murdered like the dog he is. I'll need more to go on than that. I didn't know it when we were with each other, but Elaine is actually the leader of a band of cutthroats. Bandits. They're holed up in some old dwarven ruin. Raldbathar. It's near Windhelm. They use it as their base. It's where they stage their raids. I want you to go to that ruin, find Elaine Dufont, and kill him. I don't care about his friends. Do whatever you want with them. But Elaine has to die. All right, well, you certainly, um, have a lot of conviction about this death. It will be done. Excellent. Once Elaine is dead, I'll pay you. In gold. I've saved up a bit. I hope that'll do. But... Well, there is one more thing, if you're interested. Really? I'm listening. If you can, I want you to kill someone else as well. You don't have to, not as part of our deal, but if you do, I'll pay you even more. It's Nilsin Shattershield in Windhelm. If Nilsin dies too, I'll make it worth your while. That's it? Just kill Nilsin? You'd better tell me the full story. First of all, why do you want Elaine dead? I went to Windhelm to see the Shatter Shields. They were old and dear friends, and in mourning. Frigga was killed recently. Murdered. I met Elaine in the tavern, while I was drinking my sadness away. He was handsome and charming. He said I was the beautiful Lily of his dreams. Elaine made all the pain just go away, but it was all lies. Elaine used me. He ruined my name, destroyed my friendship with the Shatter Shields. Do you know why Elaine was in Windhelm? He heard about Frigga's murder. He wanted to befriend the family in their grief and rob them blind. Elaine used me to get close to my friends, and now they all think I'm some kind of monster. Elaine Dufont took my life, and now I'm taking his. <laughs> All right. I get it. And Nilsine Shattershield, why must she die? Don't you 
you see. I was no, like I a daughter don't. to Tova, a sister to Nelsine and Frigga. But the family refuses to believe my innocence, no matter what I say. Couldn't they understand that I was used? That I was grieving for Frigga too? No, they treated me like garbage, threw me away. With Nilsine dead, maybe then Tova will realize what she's lost, huh? Maybe then she'll see that I was just as much a daughter as the others. And if not, may she drown in her own tears. <laughs> okay. That's really none of my business. Is there anything else? I planned to kill Elaine myself, you know. Nilsine too. But lost my nerve. I even brewed a special poison. Lotus extract. Maybe you could use it? Maybe. Just coat your weapon with it. Then you get the idea. Okay. Make them all pay for what they've done to me. Hmm. Huh. So these are the kind of jobs the Dark Brotherhood does. Spoiled. Women like this, spurned. Who just want to strike back at everybody that hurt them. How to slit her throat. <laughs> If I could. Ah, there's too many people around. Besides, I've been told that I need to follow the path of the Dark Brotherhood. And this might uh, put a bump in the road if I kill one of our clients. All right, let's see if I can't find uh, these people. White run. I had hoped the trip wouldn't take so long. It's already Spare daylight. Oh, look. There's Nil scene now. Please excuse my demeanor, but I'm in no mood for small talk. Neither am I. A few septums. All right, let's see. Lotus extract. Supper is all I ask. <clears throat> Hear my prayer, son of Akadosh, <clears throat> and grant peace to these departed souls. Everyone. Of Scene. You made that too easy. Mm, nightshade, I can make some more poison. And I think using the Master's Pestilence Dagger was definitely a nice touch. In tandem with the Lotus Extract. Okay, let me see if I can't find that Elaine, Elaine DeFont. Be on the lookout. The butcher could be around any corner.
just hope I'm going in the right direction. I can't see a thing in this storm. Gotcha. impressive. All right, so that looks like all the opposition. Now to find Elaine Defon. This is how they're cooking the skiva. Huh.
realize it until now. How much I enjoy. <laughs> Eliminating people. Elaine Defont should be in here somewhere. I was wondering when that poison would take hold. Hello? Sir! You eat your best shot, son! turn invisible. I think there's, well, there's several ways of doing this. needed a little distraction. And now, Mr. DeFont. Damn saber to a tiger took a good bite out of me. Need to take it easy for a while. There's someone else here. Worry about that later. Extract. Forever. Ah! 
There we go. Aegis Bane. What does this do? Reduces enemy armor rating. Okay. I hear voices back here. There's someone else here, too. Thank you, Atronach. I don't know how I would have gotten out of this one. Wow, this is incredible. I did say I needed to learn how to wield magicka. Alright, I don't think I'm going any deeper. Let's get back out of here and report into Muri. Timing couldn't be better. Well, Muri. What news? Is Elaine? He's dead. You think I'm some amateur? Thank you. That bastard got exactly what he deserved. <laughs> and I heard about Nilsine. You have more than fulfilled your part of the bargain. Please, take this as payment and a symbol of my affection. I'll never forget. Oh, you. your affection, huh? All right case. then, thank you. Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard, vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Yeah. Might consider joining up myself. You should. All right, let me go back and talk with do. Astrid. Well, well, well. Ah, you're back. So. How went your first real contract? A bit more exciting than what Nazir's been offering, I'd wager? 
<laughs> I live only to serve. Hail, Sithis. Oh, very good. Very good indeed. You, my dear, are going to fit in here quite nicely. Now, I need your assistance with a matter of a more... Mm, personal nature. Is something wrong? It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been... Well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. Hmm, you sound paranoid. Maybe so, but healthy paranoia has saved this sanctuary before, and my gut's telling me that demented little fool is up to something. And just what do you want me to do about it? Dear brother, I need you to steal into that chamber and eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No, you need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. <laughs> yes, but that seems so disrespectful. Be that as it may, we have no other choice. You need to remain unseen. Now go, before they meet, and report back to me with whatever you learn. All right. Well, do you have any idea who would conspire with Cicero? That's the real question, isn't it? The jester enters seals the door, and the conversation begins. So someone must be waiting for him inside. Any one of us could enter that chamber silently, unnoticed. But who amongst us would dare conspire against the sanctuary? The very thought breaks my heart. Is there anything else I should know? I don't believe so. But I'll be able to instruct you further after you've returned from the chamber. It depends on what you learn. And make haste. You must be in place before Cicero and his... ally arrive. They could be planning another meeting any time. What do you think Cicero is planning? Isn't it obvious? No. As the Night Mother's keeper, he believes he's entitled to rule of this sanctuary. Hmm, okay. Cicero will cite our independence as the need to revert to the old waves. He'll claim we're undisciplined, unruly, heretical even. Ironically, the Night Mother could prove to be just as much a victim. A queen in a fool's twisted game of chess. <laughs> uh, you have answers for everything, Astrid. Go, quickly. Hide in the coffin before Cicero and the traitor meet. <laughs> 